Eagle. Right leg over, right arm under. Five. Feel that sweet center. Four. Three. The lens, your two eyes, focus, two. Sweep up, eagle, bend your knees. Bend your knees enough that you can move your pelvis into a cat tilt, front of your pelvis up, tailbone down towards the mat, four. Three. Two. Sweep up, no rush, Alessi. Bring your hands to your heart center. <laughs> Standing leg raise, balance on your left leg, right knee to a square. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four. Take your upper leg to the right, gaze to the left. Bring your upper leg in front of you. Lift your arms high. Airplane. Bring your hands to your heart center, half moon. You wanna pry open your hips here. You gotta pin the big toe mound to the bottom foot into the mat and start rolling the right hip on top of your left hip. Be mindful if you're gonna stay in classical half moon, the back, the upper leg doesn't drift back. Stay here, half bow. Five, from the core. Ground the big toe mound to the bottom foot in the floor. Three, rebound up the bottom leg. From the spine line through the arms, shine out. Two, ragdoll. Bring your hands to the floor, walk your feet together. Stand up, lift your arms high. Bring your hands to your heart center. Standing leg raise, balance on your right leg. It's great to work with a strap. Take your left shoulder back, a lot of you. Yeah. Open it up, gaze right. Bring your upper leg in front of you. Lift your arms high, breathe in. Airplane. Half moon. Like my favorite moment of the day. My favorite moment. The process of fully expressing myself in Half Moon. Oh, it's wonderful. Five. Oh, what a hip opener. What a heart opener. Four. Look up to the sky and let your light shine out. Three. More. Go out more. Two. Ragdoll. Shine and bright. String bean. Bring your hands to the floor, walk your feet together, stand up, lift your arms high. Bring your hands to your heart center. Nutter adjust and left arm up, right arm down. Bend your right knee, aim, flow. Aim is everything. Five. Four. Pull your belly up to your spine. Three, kick your upper shin back. Lean forward and go up. Two, exit with ease. Bring your upper foot to the mat with your right arm up, left arm down. Bend your left knee. Grab your left ankle. Enjoy the process. Enjoy it. Look, maybe a little hint of a smile. <laughs> maybe it'll change your physiology and your psychology. Just a hint of a smile. Five, four, feels good, huh? Three, two, bring your upper foot to the mat. Okay, rope up the right ankle, a classical dancer. Ready, set, and go. And you discover, you wanna discover the essence as we become more cultured in the pose and the physical practice. Um, it goes beyond form. Bring in the air. That's formless, and you know that's true. It's moving you. Five, expansion, contraction. Four, 
One more muscle energy through your legs. Three, pull your lower ribs to the center line of your body. Expand your mid-back. Two, bring your upper foot to the floor. Dancer, left leg, ready? Enchant yourself, will you? With poetry in motion, discover it. It's not taught. Can't even be transmitted, it has to be discovered. Fully expressed from the inside out. Gotta get to the inside zone, no straining the insides. Lower ribs in. Keep the front body soft, not all rigid and hard. Five, firm your quadricep muscles up. Four, three, take the sides of your neck back. Press down, kick more, go up. Two, bring your upper foot to the mat. Three, balance on your left leg. Lift your arms above you. Pull your lower ribs in. Lower ribs in. There you go, Lindsay. That was great. Breathe in. Bring your hands to your heart center. Bring your upper foot to the mat. Tree. Balance on your right leg. Lift your arms above you. Activate your bandhas, spread your toes, fan your fingers apart, now belly up, chin down, press down, gain one more inch of altitude, get up, bring your hands to your heart center, bring your upper